Hey guys, me and Katrina here today. We just got done watching the Song Poet Opera. Super amazing opera play about the Hmong American story. But today we're gonna check out our favorite restaurant, favorite date night spot. This restaurant's amazing. It's in South Minneapolis called Martina. So let's check it out. Bass and Joe's. We were a bit early to our reservation at Martina, so we decided to stop by Sebastian Joe's beforehand. We're here at Sebastian Joe's. Pretty sweet ice cream spot here, right across from Martina. What did you get? I got the pajo and the green tea. What's the pajo? I have no idea. Some kind of chocolate thing with nuts and the pink grapefruit sorbet. Let's check it out. Mmm. It's really nice. Mmm. Yep. It has like that. Like that real grapefruit bitterness to it. Really? Mm -hmm. It's really good. Try it out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like real grapefruit. I like it. Yeah, it's really good. I love grapefruit. Yeah. Right, let me try this. This is matcha on top. The matcha is really good. The chocolate might be too much for you. Mmm. That's a nice matcha. Yeah, the matcha it, it doesn't have the matcha flavor. Mm. Chocolate. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. It's super dark. Yeah, it's very dark. I love dark chocolate too. Oh, you do? Mm hmm. So when that chocolate was, was uh, still lingering in my mouth, it has a bit of saltiness to it. And this is Martina. Their interior design is pretty sweet, so nice looking. Uh, I wanna go high beat for our stuff. Cheers up. Yeah, bananas, Brussels sprout salad, beef tartare. This is Katrina's first time eating empanadas. Give it a try. Oh, my pork just went through it. <laughs> it sounds super flaky. Whoa. Cracky. It just. Ooh, look at that. Whoa, that looks so cool. cheesy inside. Mm, it smells good. Without the sauce, first. Oh, it's so flaky. Oh, my God. Mm. Pause. So in this video, I'm using my new camera for the first time, the Panasonic Lumix LX10. It's a small pocket point and shoot camera. Unfortunately, it was not recording me when I was eating this empanada, so I'll just give it my quick thoughts. The empanada is a 3.5 out of 5. The exterior, the pastry was super flaky and delicate. The interior was cheesy and savory. It was so good. It was a little bit too easily fall apart, if that makes any sense, but again, still pretty awesome. This is actually my first time trying beef tartare. 
Every time I, every time I try to order, Katrina doesn't want me to. Toast is perfect. <clears throat> it's a great toast. Beef tartare is salty, it's covered in like sauce, parmesan, cheese. It's really similar to ahi tuna. This, this is alright. This is alright. I, I, I mess with it though. Mm. I'm gonna eat a spoonful of beef tartare. Mm. So good. Nice. Chopped up meat, minced meat, so it's easy to bite through. Wow! Look at the size of this thing compared to my hand. This is my hand. Oh man. Sand. Potato churro. Asparagus. Jesus. Seared char exterior, super fatty, moist interior. Pause. And again, when I was eating this beautiful ribeye, my camera was not recording. Quick thoughts this is a 4.5 out of 5 ribeye. The exterior was charred and smoky, the interior was moist, juicy, and fatty. It was a little bit overly salty, but other than that, amazing steak. Trina and I are stuffed. <laughs> we definitely ate with our eyes, like usual. <laughs> so we did not eat all that food. We had a bunch of it to go. Man, we barely ate that steak just because of how big it is and how full we were from the starters already. But yeah, there you go. That's me and Katrina's favorite restaurant to eat brunch at and sometimes dinner we mainly come here for brunch because it's cheaper they do a solid brunch menu check out martina if you want to take a date out yep that's it guys peace